The federal government appears to be matching words with action as regards efforts at improving power supply across the country. A contract uh, up to the tune of 3.95 billion naira has been approved by the Federal Executive Council for the construction of a transmission line, a substation and the 2 by 132 line base extension in some communities in a number state, southeast Nigeria. Our State House correspondent Chukuma Onokosi reports. The Federal Executive Council meeting held as presided over by President Gulag Jonathan. Also present were the Vice President and almost all the Ministers. Transmission infrastructure is said to have posed a problem in some communities in Anambara State. Communities like Oka Onicha, Ifiteduno, Newe and Obusi have power infrastructure overstretched. Hence the new contract as presented by the Minister of Power. Two different lots include the engineering, design, manufacture, supply, construction, testing, and commissioning of the Onichai Fitedunu 132 kV transmission line, and that is in favor of Mesa Sinotech CCC International Joint Venture. The total cost of that project, which includes um, VAT and contingency and taxes come up to 1.8 billion naira. The Minister of Health is seeking for a legal framework for all the 21 federal medical centers across the country. The Federal Executive Council approved the draft bill uh, to be sent an executive, as an executive bill to the National Assembly subject so some of the areas that council decided the Honorable Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice working with uh, the Honorable Minister of Finance and Honorable Minister of Health uh, to properly align with extant policies and laws of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. More donations are pouring in on the Safe School Initiative and the safety of schools threatened by insurgency in northeastern part of Nigeria. Recent donations were said to have been announced to the Council by the Minister of Finance. The Norwegian government uh, has um, uh, already donated 10 million Norwegian kroners. The British government uh, has also uh, made a donation of one million pounds uh, to the Safe School Initiative. Uh, this is coming from the British government uh, to support the President's initiative on uh, the, the Safe School Initiative, which the President had, had launched to uh, provide safety for school children in the Northeast. The Federal Executive Council appeals to well-meaning Nigerians in and outside the country to continue to make donations to the Safe School Initiative, at least to indicate that Nigeria is not alone in the fight against terrorism. Chukuma Onwekusi, Channels Television News.